Hi there, this is part five. Let's continue on into the greater forest. Oh, there's a book here. Let's read this first. I was beset by nostalgia this morning, boring over pictures of Gray in my diary. I first met him in 1891. We were mutual students in a study on the more esoteric side of the siege of Limoges, and what could possibly have concerned the court to execute the massacre. I saw Edgar Gray standing in a striking teal blazer, met with a refined and studied white button shirt, complemented by black dress pants. His dark green eyes stood out to me above all other defined, thin features of his beardless face. Many men in the court consider his unkept black hair frivolous and rash, but I knew it was merely the consequence of sleepless study and determined examination. His examination of Limoges intrigued me greatly, even if his peers scoffed at such unusual logic. There is only one perplexity that still interests me today. Cray spoke of the details and events on those marshy fields, and of details so precise and cleanly spoken that could only be possibly relayed by someone who had been there. But such silliness is to be dismissed. Many paintings exist of it. But Edgar and I became fast friends. Who would have thought, if all, marrying a commoner and nearly seven years after meeting. His charismatic ways, his education, his precise and logical demeanor, and his coldness. It all blended into something perfect, something I had been looking for. Okay, so that's how Edgar Gray and his wife met. Sounds like she was falling for him in the end. Okay, back on, down the path, into the greater forest, to find this uh, cathedral, apparently. If I can spot a pyramid, I can spot a cathedral. I'm sure the torches will lead me in the right direction. Ah, what have we here? Oh. Oh, here we go. Didn't have to walk so far to find it. I think this could be it. Just have to cross this uh, river here. Or stream. Yeah. Yeah, this is probably it. Okay, then. Do I go inside or do I go around? Hmm. Let's see. What's around here? Anything of interest? Blood. Yet no body. Never a body. That's strange. Okay. Can I get down there? Oh, no! You know, if I had one complaint about this game, it would be that there's way too many invisible barriers. And they always put the, the most alluring things on the other side of it. I guess I've got to go inside. I have to follow the torches. I shouldn't deviate. Or maybe I could climb up here. This looks like it was built for climbing. Again! Okay. Oh. God damn it. Alright, torch to torch. I get it. Wow, okay. Yeah, I think it's safe to say that this is in a, is in a state of disrepair. Hmm. Yes, yeah, very much so. I wonder. Can I go up there? There seems to be a tree blocking my way, but I might be able to. Nope. Okay. That's a shame. It really is. I've got to head to the very end. I see a torch. Or is that, is that a fire? That could be a torch. What 
if we go here, there's a massive hole in the ground. And by the way the tree roots and everything are placed, it looks like something just burst out of the centre. Maybe. Anyway, anything down here? It's quite a deep hole. Hmm. Okay. Okay, then. Ah, I see a book. I see a book. Let's listen. Or not. The one time I say let's listen, nobody says anything. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to read from the entry of Father Deodor Cromwell of Burke. I'm going to read page one. This church, erected at the dawning moments of this colony to immortalise our victory in independence among the trading conglomerates around us in 1832, has been my home and place of worship for so long. I have witnessed the rise of two generations of this wonderful colony, and of this town, Burke, where my church resides. Boys that became men under my wing now send their children to me to learn, as they know I speak more of doctrine and hypnotic control and the stifling of free thought. And these children will hopefully too send their own here, after my own son has succeeded me in my work for the Catholic Church. Ends in this mortal sphere. The town of Burke is a collection of twenty or so families nestled around a small fishing harbour, connected directly, as a means of trade, to a nearby gold mine. There are little other features to discuss, except the lovely oak trees and the comfortable trails leading in and around the houses, the catacombs leading through the crypts of many dead since 1832 are a means to reach Newport Colony swiftly and is of utmost importance to all of us when the bridge, which breaks often, ceases to function. It is ghoulish to use the catacombs as a means of passage, but it is only in matters of utmost desperation that we do. OK, moving on to page two. I'm not going to be reading this bit. I need time to breathe. Okay, that was the first sermon of the newfound Church of Grey. Blimey. And I cannot even begin to try and decipher that writing down at the, the bottom. I don't think that's actually any, any real writing. Maybe that's the dead language that we've heard a little bit about. I'm not sure. According to that manuscript, the only way out of the greater forest was through a catacomb entrance in the back of the church. The main road's bridge to Newport had collapsed. Okay, well I am heading towards the back of the church, so maybe I'm going to be finding the catacombs very soon. Just follow the torches. They seem to be leading me round the side. This could be it, you know. It's looking promising. Is that the, the top of a ladder I see? and a, quite a large hole in the ground. Yep. I think I'm descending the ladder. I'm going down, yeah. So this is what the residents of Burke did when the bridge was out. It doesn't look particularly safe, but I guess it will have to do. At least there's a uh, there's a light down here. Let's go. I took the lantern with me to guide my way. Right. Okay. Can I can I do that? Yep, I've got it. Hey, this is pretty cool. Without it, this would be pretty much pitch black. I like this. I feel right at home. Some sort of green orb. Ah, oh, it could be like a firefly or something that I just saw. Yeah, there it is again. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, they're probably like fireflies. They do emit some sort of light. Anyway, let's uh, let's get through. This is going to lead me to the Newport Colony, apparently. I 
What is that up there? Or is that just water running down the side? Oh! Wait! What the fuck? Um... Something threw that like it was a toy. That's got away quite a lot, really. There's nothing in there. What the fuck? Uh, let's just get through here as fast as possible. Here lies Dorian Khan. Dorian, the assistant? Somebody did say he was going to kill him. Is that his little cross? Huh. Okay. Yeah, let's just, let's just get through this. Is that the way out? Oh shit, hang on. Whoa! Someone's got a fire going over there. And, you know... Damn you, water! The flame. It's gone. Although there was... Yeah, there's one back here. Might as well take this one. Maybe I can throw it around the water. Something like that? I don't know. There might be a workaround for this. Yeah. Bloody hell, this place is dark. Let's grab it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I grabbed the lantern, but the fire doesn't want to come with me. That sucks. God damn. Okay. Just going to have to deal with the natural light, I guess. Or maybe I'll find another lantern at some point. Alright, first things first. What's over here? Someone's buried here. Th this can't be the way out. So... Let's go back. I suppose I should have a head over to the fire. So many of these green firefly things. Aphids? I don't know. Uh, let's go over here first. The door has completely been ripped off, and the cage surrounding this chain is gone. Can I use this? I saw another one of these uh, around there. Can I use this? I can. The chain's coming down. Okay. What did that do? Whoa. Oh shit. Who turned out the light? Yeah, these two are doing a brilliant job. What the fuck is this? What was that? I, I can barely see anything at this point. I, I don't know. What's going on? There's something very bright all the way over there. Anything around this? A book, maybe? Okay. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just gonna stay away. Is this a door or a bridge or something? The fuck's all this? Ah, did that chain have something to do with this chain? They're not. They're not quite in balance. So. Oh, the water weights, right? Well, I pulled the chain. Maybe I shouldn't have. Or, possibly, maybe I need to pull the other one, which was over here. But that had a, that had a, I think that had a cage around it. Hang on, let me just get closer. Is there a book around here? No. Good. Don't want to get close to that fire. Right, I think I think this lever over here had a, cha uh, a cage around it. Okay, it doesn't anymore. But it did. And that was what the chain was about. Right, yes, okay. So. And the noise stirred them from their slumber. I had to escape. Did it? Yeah, let's get this over with. Go on. Oh dear. I don't like that sound. Oh dear, what the hell was that? Something. 
Is the ceiling falling down? Oh dear. Oh shit, there's one there. Oh crap. I can barely see it. Whoa! Uh, they're up. They're out. Oh dear. Okay. I can see the weight lifting up. And I can see the door opening. I've got to get over there. I'm just going to hug this wall. What the shit? How did that happen? Yeah, fuck it, I don't want to know. Let's just keep going. Shit. Right, I should be able to go under there now. Yeah, let's go. Ooh, crap, 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 crap. Let's go. Why don't I have that gun anymore? Right, that's got me my way out. Light at the end of the bridge. It was my way out. Yeah. To the beaches. Right, it's way out to the beaches. What is what's going on with this bridge? Oh shit. Okay. Alright. It's nice knowing you all. Slippy as well. Ooh shit. <laughs> okay. One way only. I don't think I'll be going over there again. <laughs> Let me out of here. Let's go. Right. Made it to the beaches. Excellent. And there it was. Newport Colony. A shell of its former self in my eyes. Blazing across the Atlantic against the cloudy night sky. I knew I had reached my goal at last, and that my answers resided here. Here, in Newport. Right, okay, I've made it to Newport Colony. It looks like a lot of it is on fire. It's quite a way in the distance. Um, we'll get over there in video 6.